It's a cosine movie. Well, design, don't worry. Design. I'm out. Those people didn't even see my fucking design. And they're designing other things. It's not okay. It's not okay. It's not fucking okay. They're going to design something. I'm not. Guys, it is now established that for every pre-brother with that preparation, there must be fight, argument, and altercation here and there, as Liema decided to walk out from the group that she was in, simply because her group member are not paying attention to her, and they are not taking her very, very serious, knowing fully well that she is the one with the most idea about the Kosan thing, and as she willingly decided to leave the group, a voice actually told her, by Felicia, and some people on social media are Assume that it was Mpumi that said by Felicia and they have been dragging, insulting. In fact, Mpumi fans and Lema fans they have started a serious fight on social media. Meanwhile, it may seem as though Lema really won that group to fail that design of 18, knowing fully well that she is the one with the most idea about what they are going to design. They threw away my design. They're gonna start over some bullshit because I'm the only one who knows. Thing. Yo, let's quickly get right into the video now because we are in for another interesting gist. So the housemates have been brief about this week wager and it is basically based on their culture, based on the fact that it is based on their culture. The housemates, they are super confident that they are actually going to win this week wager as the wager 80% because for them, it is their culture. They are super really confident that they are going to win it 80%. You must... You must base your wager on how confident you feel. Okay, 80 again. How many is it? Okay, meaning we are... 181. Imagine some people we are even wagering 100%. Guys, I laugh in Spanish because I know these people, they don't know how chaotic their preparation used to be. And how some of their fellow housemates will be sabotaging their effort without their own notice. So after the wagering, Mish went back to the diary room to tell Big Brother that they are wagering 100%. Ladies and gentlemen, that was when they started grouping themselves. And guys, that was when slight basketball started happening here and there because some has met we are like this is the group that i want to belong to even though they are being advised by other has met, this is the group that fits you the most just join this group or more at that particular point in time slight basketball started happening here and there Guys, at the end of the day, each and every housemate find a group and fit themselves. Meanwhile, why all these things we are going on, conversation we are going on here and there. Here comes a conversation between Z and Young Papi that contradicted a conversation she had earlier had with Sina Ye. I'm trying to cuddle. I'm trying to cuddle. In that conversation, she was hard telling young papi that she is trying to cuddle and she even went ahead to tell young papi how he has not been paying attention. Guys, honestly speaking, it, it kind of contradicted the conversation she earlier had with Shinaye when Shinaye asked her what her love language is. Ladies and gentlemen, when Shinaye asked her what's her love language. Aside from acts of services, like what else do you think is your love language? Quality time. I've noted that. The end. Physical touch, not, not that much. That much. Mm -hmm. Guys, honestly, knowing fully well that I have this conversation on record and hearing Z talking about cuddling and the young puppy not paying attention, it really got me surprised and shocked because I was just like, uh uh. Uh -uh. Although in my mind, I am beginning to think that seriously, Z is actually playing a two card in that house with Shinaye. She is playing a card of, okay, since you are playing a card of, I came inside this house with a serious boundary. Let me help you keep this boundary, but we are going to be very, very close. And whenever you seriously make advances on me, people will definitely see it that you are the one that defies the boundary you said you came into Big Brother and Zamzi season four with. And nobody will blame her for throwing herself at you meanwhile with young papi i feel the game she is playing with young papi is you said you are in a relationship you do not intend to disrespect your girlfriend outside the house let's see how far you can go with this your strategy and game hence she allowed herself to be kissed by young papi and she has as well told sinaya that she is not going to start anything serious with young papi because of the age difference guys in this particular game that these three people are playing who do you think is actually going to win or lose as 
in this game but i feel may the best player win the game guys for jared and liema jared discovered that liema has been acting in a certain type of way ever since they started their wager preparation and jared knowing fully well that today is nomination decided to call liema to order to remind her that she should know that nomination is today and she should play her game and leave her feeling aside I'm playing the game and if feelings are involved, I will put my feelings in it. But for Liema, she says she is playing the game and if feelings are involved, she will put her feelings in it. And all these things is because of the fact that Jared is actually looking out for Liema so that she will not chop nomination, come tonight nomination process. This is where I'll be ending this particular video. Let me know your thoughts. Subscribe to my channel, please.